Alright, welcome to Brain Master's videos. Okay, today I'll be doing on quadratic equation, the intersection of two graphs. Okay, where the question in this form will be, you'll be given two equations and they will ask you to find the unknown m. Okay, so this is the question. Find the range of values of m for which the line y equals to 4 plus 2x intersects the curve y equals to 3x squared plus mx plus 7. Okay, so two parts. First one is at two distinct points. And the second is at as a tangent. So, what you have to do is, whenever they give you the two equations, you will equate them equals to each other first. So, this is what you do. I have um, 4 plus 2x okay, equals to 3x squared plus mx plus 7. So, what I'll do, I'll shift everything over to okay, one side and set it equals to 0. So, what I have is, I'll have this thing. Okay, 3x squared plus mx minus 2x plus 7 minus 4 equals to 0. I'll do a simplifying. Okay, so 3x squared plus m minus 2x plus 3 equals to 0. So my a will be 3, b will be m minus 2, and c will be 3 again. So with this value now, I'm able to solve for my part a. Okay. Knowing that they want two distinct points means that my b squared minus 4ac will be more than 0. So substituting all these values in, so I have m minus 2 squared minus 4 times 3 times 3 is more than 0. So what I'll do, I'll expand this part. Okay, m squared minus 4m plus 4 minus 36 is more than 0. So, simplify further. And I'll factorize this to give me m minus 8. m plus 4 must be more than 0. So, using the previous chapter, we'll know that we have to find this. This is 8 and this is negative 4 for this value here and they want more than zero so is this value here all right so therefore for this part for my m my m will have to be m must be smaller than negative four or my m have to be greater than eight so this is my answer where i have two values to fulfill for uh, intersection of point when i substitute them in okay now for the second part where b as a tangent, so as a tangent means that my b square minus 4ac have to be equals to 0. So same thing, I'll substitute my points a, b and c inside. But in this case, because it's set equals to 0. So, see the link? They are actually the same. This part is the same, so I'll just copy from here. I'll have m square minus 4m minus 32 equals to 0. So when I do my factorizing, I'll have n minus 8 and m plus 4 equals to 0. So by solving this, my m will be, therefore, the answer will be m equals to 8 or m equals to negative 4. So these are the two values if I will substitute in to the equation. Then when they intercept, they will only give me one point similar. Okay, so this is your answer and your explanation. So if you like our teaching videos, do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Okay, or you may also go on to our blog here for more related questions to practice on. Okay, thank you.